had good accelerations from 120 to about 150. So. Okay. Look at this. She's so fashionable, looking so good. So we're hanging out, still waiting for stuff to happen. Baby's definitely low. I can definitely feel like it feels like she's lower. It's a much different experience because usually I would have had my water broken at six centimeters. I could be seven or eight. I don't really know right now. They haven't checked me, but it feels different. Like usually at six when my water gets broken, then the pain like really kicks in. And I have a feeling that I'm not gonna feel pain until my water breaks. So if we don't break it, then, I mean, it hurts. The contractions hurt, my back hurts. But it's not like unbearable. So I could be pretty far along. I'm not really sure. So we don't have a baby yet. No. We don't have a baby. Yeah. For hat day at school. <laughs> I'm about to get in the pool. I am at nine centimeters right now. My water is still intact. We haven't broken it. I honestly am surprised because we were just talking about having to break it if I didn't have any change. And I was thinking that it wasn't going to be any change. Um, but ta da! So we can feel a contraction coming on. And they're starting to get a lot more intense. Um, so yeah. So I can play my music and focus, and we're gonna have a baby so soon. Can I go here? Mm -hmm, it's crazy. It's it awesome. doesn't feel real. And after losing almost 100 babies, what? as a midwife and as a nurse, I've seen even more, and I've never seen somebody just get this far. I will tell you that I had a lot of anxiety with Adeline's birth, and it made me a little fearful, like even going into labor this time, and that could have played into stalling it. But like, for me, it's like, it would be so wonderful to get through it without the pain. And so for me, I see it as like, God's... And you've gone through it without the pain. Right. And you've gone <laughs> 40 what, weeks, <laughs> yeah. almost 41 weeks. That's what I mean, I see it as like God's, that's what you want. His grace and his like, thin ask and you shall receive. Mm -hmm. Well, you have definitely received. Because yeah. <laughs> I'm like, there's no way anybody would believe that you were nine centimeters. Yeah. The way you just stand there talking to me to, through the contraction. I think so. It's up to you. I'm waiting out. I just don't feel comfortable waiting too much right. longer. <laughs> well, that really excited the baby. You saw how the baby was moving, like. It's obviously the contractions, even though they're far apart, they. She's 10 now. <laughs> Can you imagine she's 10 now? Yeah, she's <laughs> and smiling. <laughs> 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 Did you just break your water? Yeah. Okay, try. So, go ahead and write it down. Yeah. I think that's nice. Okay. she's like it. <laughs> yeah, I can feel it. <laughs> Baby, baby Murray, <laughs> Murray girl number five is here. It took a little bit longer than anticipated, a lot more work than Daniel anticipated, but she is well worth it. Wow. Can I say hi? Yeah, I don't think you could have gone around. Hi. She's really welcome. She's looking at you guys. 
Lisa, I am gonna need you to watch out, Kyle. Mm -hmm. Hold him just like this. Okay. You know how you cut with scissors at school? Mm. Yeah. Like this? Yeah. Like this? Yeah. 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 Ye
Um, but we're gonna take some well needed and deserved time for Danielle to rest and to just uh, enjoy the night and enjoy our new little baby whose name is... <laughs> <laughs>